uh, revealed. It is not for a prophet to be uh, fraudulent and Yahula, a variant reading as the passive and I don't know what yeah, what, Yuvala, does, what does fraudulent mean? What does fraudulent mean? Okay, but fraud, right? He's a fraud. So the, yeah, yeah, the yeah. Muslims accusing their prophet to be a fraud. Who? The Muslims. Those are the companions of the Prophet. They went they went to war. They went to war with Muhammad and now they they stole we're yeah, talking, we're talking. The, they, they stole the booty and now they are coming and now they accuse they, the, 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 we can call them the disciple of Muhammad. They accuse Muhammad of his teen underwear. Who is the one insulting Muhammad Bayer? Some people some people begin. They are Muslims. Say perhaps mm. the Prophet took perhaps. Mm. So I don't see spirit. I don't see. If a Christian uh, call me, if a Christian said uh, to me uh, now, if a Christian, go, if a Christian go. said to me, the oh, Christian uh, prince he he took, he took illegally, and lawfully, he's a fraud. And you make, listen, you make your own. Uh, how do you say that? Your own hmm. scenario. Okay. You read something and you uh, say uh, it is stealing and it is this and it is that. No. Hmm. I, I read well, this is what the word Yahul mean. Here we go. Meaning, Yahul, here we go. The, the, the passive or Yahul, meaning and to attribute him with fraud. Do you see it? Yes. I okay. So the Muslims accusing Muhammad of a fraud. Not for the Prophet to be. Yes. Okay. What's yes? The Muslim accusing Muhammad is a fraud. I thought. The Muslim. Those are the Muslims. They, they are calling him a prophet, and they are the one who is looking for the booty. All the Muslims, they are the one. Muslims live together. Now they are dividing the booty. They found that the red and the way is missing, and they are suspecting Muhammad is the one who took it. We're not gonna agree about this uh, subject. We can go to another subject. No Maybe, problem. Uh... Okay, let us go to the subject. We were talking about your uh, 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 Muslim was speaking about Muslim defer the law of Moses. Can you show me, you must have you do circumcision. Can you show me from the Quran where Allah command you to circumcise yourself? Okay. I just want to ask you something before I... Uh, is Abraham uh, circumcised? Yes, he is. According to your prophet, he hit himself with the hammer. According to Christianity. Yeah, he is. And? He is. Mm -hmm. Is your God not perfect? Didn't he uh, Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. You're, change, you're trying to run away. No, you're trying to run away. Because I want to show everybody that you must be don't follow Moses. If you follow Moses, then where is the God of Moses command you? Listen, you are changing the topic. I ask you, where in Islam, where in the Quran, you see, here we go, here we get drama. Where in the Quran, my friend, you are running away because you know, because you know you can answer. You cannot play that games with me. I am from a very other level. I see every day. Mr. Upper Level, can you show me, Mr. Upper I Level, your, your Majesty, Your Majesty, can you please, day. can you please show me where in the Quran it command you to do circumcision? I can show you from the Old Testament. Listen, I can show you from the Bible where God command the circumcision. Here we go. So, are you going to show me or not? Are you going to show me? Islam is dying. Isn't your prophet? He says that Islam, Islam is start as a strange here. But they, they all of them, they are like a radio machine. He will let people. Your churches. Are empty. He will let not know our churches is full and your mosque is empty. Your mosque is empty. You, I can show you things. Not only your mosque only get busy when there is women there. I can show you. Listen, 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 listen Abdul. Don't change the topic. You are running away. Why Allah, why Allah right. never command you to do circumcision? Why? You don't want to let me why? Because, because you don't you answer. Don't you are changing everything. You want to talk about everything yeah. except the question. You are just a kid. I you said you are an upper have... level. I repeat the question. Why Allah never command you to do circumcision? Go ahead. Uh, because we are following not only Allah, we are following uh, also our prophets of the prophets of Allah. Yeah. And if uh, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, command us, command us to uh, circumcise because it's, it is an Abrahamic tradition, we do that. Because Wonderful. Guys, it is Abrahamic. So why Muhammad never circumcised? Can you show me a reference that your Prophet himself? Shouldn't he follow the first one to follow it? Your Prophet never circumcised himself. Is that true? 
I, ne I never, I never saw uh, with all uh, respect my uh, the body of my uh, prophet. Yes. But... No, you have reference. You talk about Muhammad when he clean his bum. You talk about when he shake his penis. You talk about everything. So now you are saying to me that you Muslim, you forgot to mention if he did circumcise or not. The only religion. Monotheist, monotheistic religion. You are not monotheist, okay. Yes. As long as you claim to be a monotheist, listen. You see, why you are changing topic? Like we were talking about yes. circumcision. Suddenly you talk about monotheism. It is also about, it is also about circumcision. No, where is this? Okay, can you show can me the I command? So you are saying can to I me, we don't follow Allah, we follow Muhammad. We yes. follow Muhammad. Yes. If Allah never said, if Allah no. never said circumcise, you should no. not follow they, a man. Is it yes, the Quran? They don't want to, they, listen, they listen. They only want to follow their desires. Listen, yes. listen, listen, so, listen. Okay, okay, listen. listen. Okay, the Quran, they, they says, the Quran says, the Quran says, the Quran says, if you take, if you take the command of the man over the command of God, you made the man God. They are loving Christianity because there are no rules. I can do whatever I want. False. I can false. Want. False. Yes. You are a big right. fat liar. Right. Okay. Can you show me where in the Bible it says you can do whatever you want? Can you yeah. show me? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I will expose every single Muslim by using it. Can you show me where in the Bible it says we can do anything we want? What I want. That is Christianity. Can you show me? Can you show me what you are saying? I can show you that you can do that. I can show you from the Quran that homosexual can go to heaven. Yes or no? I can show you in the in the Bible that drunk people, people who fornicate, people who commit sin, people who they are thieves, people who they are liars, they cannot go to heaven. Can you show me in the Quran that somebody is homosexual cannot go to heaven? Jesus. Yeah, are you forcing me to hang up on you? Are you forcing me to hang up on you? Are you forcing me to hang up on you? Why you don't want to talk adult? Because you know you are. So no, you made an argument. You see, you change topic now in the front of everybody. In the front of everybody, can you show me? Can you show me? Listen, listen. We cannot keep. We cannot keep going this way. Let us talk like adults. Shut up. Shut up, potato. Potato, you're a potato. You're scared. Let us have a conversation. I'm willing to show you the evidence that the Quran says homosexual thieves, drunk, all kinds of people, they, they will go to heaven guaranteed. I can show you from the Bible that the one who is drunk, the one who is a thief, the one who is a fornicator, the one who is a liar, the one who is a cheater, he will not go to heaven. Can you do the same? Can you... Uh, uh... Can you repeat it again? What, you are not listening, you right? Okay, I'm asking you. Yeah, I can show you. I can show you from the from my Bible yeah. that thieves, idolaters, adultery, fornicators, drunken people like this, they cannot go to heaven. They cannot go they to heaven. Not, can you show not, me in the Quran? Did you say that? Did you say that? Did I what? Did you say that people that? that uh, are drinking, that fornicate, that raping, that they are never go to heaven. They will never go to heaven, yes. Wow. Can you show me I that from your phone? So can you show me that from your phone? Can I, can I answer or not? Go ahead. I am so glad. People, if you are watching this and uh, people from the chat, mm -hmm. please come to Islam because our Allah forgive everything exactly only, so a homosexual only, will be in heaven only, allah never only, said in the quran allah never said you see you, you guys look at the lies look at the lies a second ago listen listen a second ago shut up shut up let me let me let me make a comment about what she said you just gave me victory shut up shut up shut up just listen for a second just a second listen just a second you just said in the, in the beginning you accuse a christianity you accuse a christianity that in christianity you can do anything anything and you go to heaven now you just say it you can be a homosexual and you go to heaven in a christianity you cannot in islam you can so you are the one who accuse us with something it is you who do it do you see how hypocrite so muhammad is a fraud he cannot be from god because he promised you as a as if you are a homosexual listen this is the this is the bible this is the bible you so you just say Everybody heard you. They will say you didn't. You Everybody didn't. heard you. A drunk people. And by the way, where in the Quran it says if you ask for repentance, if you are a homosexual, you go to heaven. You are a liar. In the Quran it says, whoever believe in Allah and the last day and Prophet Muhammad, he will go to heaven. 
Allah forgive all kind of sin if you say shahada. You do not need to repent. You do not need to repent. You will. You will. Yeah, you will be a, you will be a Muslim prince, and uh, may Allah guide you. Yes. What, uh, are truth. you going to run? Yes. Are you going to run? May Allah guide you to the truth. Are you going yes. to run? Are you going to run after we discover that you Muslims? Yes. You can be for Nokia. So, so why? So listen, listen, listen. So, so why? So why Allah? All what He required from you as a Muslim? Why Allah required from you only to say shahada, and you will be in heaven? And why in Christianity, if you are not obeying God? If you are a thief, if you are greedy, if you are drunken, if you are a homosexual, if you are, if you are, if you are fornicators, you will not go to heaven. How come in Islam, Allah made it so easy to go to heaven, just say shahada? How come in Christianity, Jesus says, not everyone says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of my father, but the one who does as well. I am not going to run. I am working. I have a night shift till 7 o'clock. Ah, you are calling me from work. I am here with you till seven o'clock in the morning. Yes. Oh, okay, so answer me. So why Allah allow you to be a homosexual just by saying shahada you go to heaven? Go ahead. Okay. Are you, uh, you gonna let me answer without interrupting? Yeah, but don't change topic, go ahead. Uh, Prince? Yeah, go ahead. You gonna let me talk without interrupting? Yeah, but don't change topic, because each time I say something I to you, answer. you jump okay. to different thing. I will answer about okay. the topic. All right. You gonna let me talk or not? All right. Yes, Allah will forgive every sin if you repent. Yes, you have three condition, three conditions. Yeah, that Allah will repent. It is stay away from the sin. Yes, uh, 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 asking uh, repenting and have a deep, a deep. Uh, how do you say that? That you are. Um, uh, regret of the fault that you did. Mm. Then Allah will uh, uh, go to uh, the Bible, Ezekiel. Mm. It is in Ezekiel, uh -huh. but uh, your God in your Bible, mm. yes, also when you repent and stay away from the mm. uh, God, God will uh, forgive you. Okay. Are you done? Yes. All right. Yeah, I am done. Okay, well, all the condition you mentioned to me are not exist, this is a lie. Because your prophet, he said, as an example, unless you accuse your prophet to be a liar, he said, if you say the name of Allah 100 times, all your sin is forgiven. For the past year, listen, let me go, here we go. see, don't let me talk. You don't let me talk. So, okay, so if you say, Bismillah, 100 times, Allah forgive your sin for the past year, and for the coming year. So if a homosexual, very, uh, hold, on, a, hold, on, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, no problem. So uh, uh, if you say, if you say it 100 times, you do not need to repent, you just say it. And, and when you call me, I ask you about ablution, if you remember, you said to me, the second you do ablution, Allah forgive your sin, is that correct? You said that? Yes. Okay. So if a homosexual, he did not, no, he did not no. repent. Not okay. A, not a oh, okay. No. Okay. Well, let us see if this is true or not. A homosexual, he prayed to Allah. He says shahada. He go to heaven. And I can show you from the hadith that okay. you Muslims have a homosexual imam in the time of the caliphate. And the, the caliphate, he says, you should obey and follow. Is that correct? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I thought you are the Muslim who have upper level of you forgot. You said to me, you said to me, you said to me, you said to you me, you're you, you, from a caliphate yeah. uh, more than a thousand years ago. What, what are you talking about? Yeah, you, isn't it your prophet was a thousand years ago? So now you do not know? Suddenly you yes, do not know? You said to me, you said, you said to me, you are upper level. You said to me, you said to me, you are upper level. Who said to me, you, he is the upper level, you, right? You said that to me. So I'm asking you now, is it okay for a, a homosexual to be an imam in the mosque? Yes or no? Of course not. Of course not? So if I show you now the hadith, which is but, showing but, that. But, but wait, no. it is not of course not a question. You said, you just said, of course not. Yeah. Now suddenly it's okay. So are you saying now, okay, you take it back. So are you saying now it's okay to be a homosexual and you are the leader in the mosque? Okay, but if you, every human is a sinner. 
This is, this, don't change topic. Don't change topic. We're talking about the Imam. This is another question. This is another question. Is it okay to be an Imam? You said to me. You said to me. You have to repent. The guy is an Imam leading the prayer, and he is a homosexual. Can be? Can he be approved as a homosexual Imam? Yes or no? If people uh, know he is a homosexual, of course uh, he cannot be. Uh, a uh, uh, imam anymore, but don't but me, don't but me. Here we go. This is the hadith. This is the this is the daif hadith. This is the daif hadith in the front of you. You are answering. Don't waste my time. This is a, this is a daif hadith. The Muslim they came to the caliphate and they told him we are praying behind a gay who is tempting us. He is tempting them. I don't accept daif hadith. Well, okay. So why you don't accept daif hadith? Explain to us why you don't accept daif hadith. Because uh, they are calling da'if, you know what da'if means or not? No, I tell me. Explain I don't speak the, Arabic. To your audience what da'if means. I don't know, you tell me. You are the Muslim who knows. You are the... Okay, so the, do you accept my explanation? Okay, da'if mean, da mean, no, mean no. that Muslims, they are a bunch of liars. You can't trust what they say. <laughs> Now we are liars. Okay, okay so why you now so, okay? So now you tell me what the if you see you, you asked me to tell them what the if is, and now you don't now want me to so tell them what the if is. Now we are liars. The if means it's not uh, how do you say that? Uh, not a trust uh, exactly. Worry, uh, they are liars, they are not trustworthy, they are not trustworthy, uh, they are liars. Okay. Uh, listen, uh, listen. It is not about the lying, it's about the chain of narration. Ah yes. chain of narration. So what ah, so so are you saying to me are, if the hadith is true, but just because you don't have a chain of narration, Allah was not able to preserve it for you? Okay. Can I say something or not? Don't say something. This hadith, first of all, is Sahih, is not Daif. This is a Bukhari. And I got you busted. So this is Al-Bukhari, and this is not Da'if. So now we, we took the carpet from underneath of your feet. And I said you, we you, don't accept Da'if. This is not Da'if. This is Al-Bukhari. I was joking with you. If you say now it is Sahih, I will accept it. Okay, so here we go. An Imam, he is a gay. You said to me in the beginning, no, it's not accepted. To be an Imam, to be a gay. So now when you say to me, if you repent, how we repent? The guy is already an imam and he is a gay when he is praying with the Muslims. And the caliphate, he assign him, he says, so what? Pray behind him. Even, listen, listen, we have even murderers, yeah? In the mosque, yeah, they are praying. This is not the question. 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 Can I say something? You said to me, you said to me, uh, a person who uh, repent, he is a gay uh, now, he is a gay. Do, when he pray, do. Listen, when he pray, he is even tempting the Muslims. When he pray, the Muslims are tempted because he have a nice ass. Read it. Okay, can we read it uh, together? Read it. No, I do not know if you read it. Go ahead. Uh, from I went or not? Yeah, from I went, yeah. I went to Uthman bin Affan, an, where he was uh, besieged and said to him, you are the chief of all Muslim in general, and you see what happens, what's, right? what has befallen you. We are led in Salat, prayer by a leader of al fitan trials and affliction, etc. And we are afraid of being sinful in following him. Uthman said, as Salat, the prayers is the best, best of all deeds. So when the people do good deeds, do the same with them. And when they do bad deeds, avoid, wow, a beautiful hadith. Uh, as Zuhri said, in your op uh, opinion, one should not offer salat be behind an Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, unless there is no, I don't read. Uh, unless there alternative. is alternative. No, I don't. Huh? Alternative. Okay, that's good. Okay, yeah, what's but you said to me, you said to me, you have to repent to go to heaven. And now the leader of the prayer, the one who will take you to heaven by praying behind him, he is tempting the Muslims. Listen, he is tempting them. You gave me the answer. Listen, you read it. Oh, thank you. So he, he is tempting them. Let, let me ask. Let me ask you. It's, it's Sahih. Uh, why? Why the Muslims are being tempted by his ass if they are not gays themselves too? The one is complaining. I don't like this garbage language. What do you if mean? You want to talk, it says uh, here, about... it says here, he is tempting them, affliction, etc. So when he pray, they get tempted. Why they are getting tempted? Unless everybody in the mosque is a homosexual too. If a man, he bent over in front of you. How a man, he is not a homosexual will be 
inflicted by a game. Where are you? you are, listen, you are uh, Arab. Eh? I am not from Arab. I don't I'm care if I'm an Arab, no, no, this is not, who care? I'm asking you, don't change the topic. If a man he is a gay and he is a praying no, in front of you, no, why those Muslims no. are getting tempted by the gay? Obviously, they are gays too. So look at, look at the hypocrites. Look at the hypocrite Muslims. They are complaining that the imam is a gay, but obviously they are gays because they are getting tempted by the ass of the gay. How he tempt them? Can you tell me? How he tempt them? Can you explain? Go ahead. Again, own story. And that is what you were. It's not my own story. I have it in front of you. And you read it yourself. And this is authentic. This is Al Bukhari. Does it say, does it say they are being tempted? Does it say they are being, he is giving them a trial? Does it say that he is doing fitna, which means he is tempting them? Yes or no? Where? Can you uh, let me. Uh, it says in front of us, you are the one who did read, you forgot? I read, I, I, I read the story, but I didn't read uh, Tempted or something else. Yeah, it says we are okay, it's a, a, a Imam of Al Fitna. What Al Fitna mean? Temptation of bad things. So, a trial, this is the Muslim translation, affliction, etc. Al Fitan, leader of Al Fitan. No, Al Fitna, Fitna, Imam of Fitna. You don't speak, you don't know Arabic. Here we go. It says here in Arabic, let me show you. Fitna, not Al Fitan. Fitan is something else. Fitna. Imam, Imam Fitna, Imam Fitna, okay? And now, and this, is a, this is the stupid translation saying that. This is not even translation. It is Imam Fitna. Let me show it to you. Listen, come on, my, my friend. It's recorded. If, I'm, if I am lying, people who speak Arabic, they will get me busted. Okay, read it. No, no, you don't read it, Fitan, because it's not what it is. And so even if Al-Fitna, al Fitan, it's the same. At the end of the day, it's the same. Al-Fitna is somebody deceiving you, a liar, tempting you. Satanic, Fitna is from Shaitan. So this guy is an Imam of Shaitan. That's what Fitna is about. And they are tempted, and they are the one in the Muslim in translation oh, saying, trial, affliction, etc. Okay, how this person will make you in a trial by praying behind him? He is a gay. You are lying. Okay, it's in front of you. Fitnatin al Fitnatin. But if I go to Google and I do leader of Al Fitan, I see thirty seven groups of leaders. And you are talking about Muslims, yeah. Muslims are leader of Fitan. They, they are the one who yeah, fears but they are the one who follow Shaitan. Yeah, you are right. Can you go to no no no? Can you go to Google and do leader of Al Fitan? My friend, I speak Arabic. Arabic my language. It's it's, it's your it's your yes. it's your business now. Listen, listen. So they, uh, they are being to, okay. What affliction mean? What affliction okay. and trial mean? Why they, why they are? Don't tell me go. I speak Arabic. This is my language. People, they can go. No problem. Listen, they are saying here Al Fitna between two bracket Al Fitan according to you trial and affliction trial and affliction so what what is the trial the what is the muslim trial by praying behind this man what is the affliction and the trial uh, you uh, you ask me something or not ask you something can i answer yeah you go ahead. Can, you answer, uh -huh. can i answer without uh -huh. something uh -huh. oh. listen it is for me yeah no problem if the, uh, the imam yeah, uh -huh. is a murderer, a homo, only if he don't come committing shirk. If he, if he, if he is a sinner, if I do my prayer behind someone, wh what does that mean? That my prayer uh, is not uh, valid? It's bullshit. Bullshit, because exactly. Allah... Okay, no problem. But, but you see what happened now? You just say it. You just say the imam is a murderer or a homosexual. But he is the imam approved to be an imam by Allah. And you said to me, as long as he don't commit shirk, he's fine. He will go yeah. to heaven. So this is what we said. In the beginning, you start saying, in the beginning, you open your radio station nonstop. You're saying, the Christian, they can do whatever they want. The Christian, they can sleep around. The Christian, they can sin. It turned to be, it turned to be, it is you. It is you. You are worshiping a man. You are worshiping a man. It's you, Muslim, worshiping a man. Is it true? Okay, listen, 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 listen. Is it true? Is it true that you Muslims, you Muslims, drink the the the, the piss of Muhammad? Yes or no? If I'm lying, tell, tell everybody. If I am lying, tell everybody. I drink rather pee of a donkey 
and worshiping a man. Yes? Will you worship you or you drink a donkey? I can I, show you the hadith. I you drink a donkey pee. But this is, listen, listen. So now I give me don't 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 step on the question. I don't care what you prefer. I'm asking you why you drink the piss of Muhammad. You see how the Muslims run away from the question? I am not asking you what you prefer to do. I'm asking you, can you give us the reason? Listen, listen. Can you give us the reason? Can you give us the reason? You will not you will not get away with it. Can you give me the reason to drink the piss of Muhammad? God is not a man. Can you God is not a man who lie? The Bible says God is not a man who lie. Listen, God your God in the Quran says, listen, 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 okay, we're going, we're going. do you want me to hang up on you? Are you, ask, are you asking me to hang up? Are you, ask, are you asking me to hang up? Are you asking me to hang up or you want to have a conversation, radio station? Do you want to talk to me or you want to talk alone? So why are you not answering? Give me the reason why you Muslim drink the piss of Muhammad. You say that Muslim don't worship Muhammad. So give us the reason we're listening. Go ahead. Never, Why I, must they drink the piss of Muhammad? I never, I never drink urine. <laughs> this is not a question. Is it true or I'm lying? Is it true or I am lying that the one who drink the piss of Muhammad, he will go to heaven, according to your prophet? Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't uh, know. A second I, ago, you are a high I'm level. Not. Now you do not know? The Islam is very simple, and that's why... Exactly, it it's very simple. You can be a homosexual, you can be a thief, you can be a, a criminal. Just say, don't do commit shirk, but at the same time, you drink the piss of Muhammad. But is it, this is a shirk? When you're Muslim, you say shahada. When you're Muslim, when you're Muslim you say shahada. What do you do? When you say shahada, you commit shirk. You are not monotheist. You are not monotheist. Now, listen, I'm asking you. Why you Muslims, why you Muslim drink the piss of Muhammad? Wow. He's, he's singing for me now. Listen. Okay. So you see, you see how stupid the Quran. Allah is saying, Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. How come Allah is saying, Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen? Allah is not God because He is the one saying, Thanks to Allah. Read the Quran. It is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let us read the Quran. Read, we did read the Quran. It says that Muhammad is a thief. The Muslim accused him to be a thief. And here we go. This is your Muslim website saying, you see, you refuse, you refuse to answer. I will get you busted in front of everybody. The benefit, shut up. You are a radio station. You will never answer. Just take, take a hike. Take a hike and take your bike with you. The benefit of drinking the blessed urine of your holy prophet, of our holy prophet, 